Speaking to NBC News, Regional Commander of the Commerce Region, Commissioner Ismail Basson, stressed that the suspects cut the chains used to lock the gate into the farm and proceeded to steal meat and chicken trays with a value of $15,000. However, unbeknown to the criminals, members of the Special Reserve Force and Serious Crime Investigation Subdivision were aware of the robbery and eventually ambushed them and fired shots as the suspects attempted to flee. It seems like the, 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 the outbreaking and, and others in town itself it becomes a bit smaller. Now people are moving out. And then uh, we are just happy for having that information of uh, having been tipped off by the owner, having received, uh, pick, pick up the information. That's how we, 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 we were able to arrest them. And, and definitely if these guys will, they were arrested last night, most definitely they will appear on Monday in court. Bason says one suspect managed to flee and the two were arrested after sustaining injuries and have since been admitted at the Katutura Hospital. We are just calling on the public to, to really be on the lookout for the criminals that are really becoming uh, very much unruly. Uh, lucky to say that uh, the owner, nobody was injured on the farm. They just come to pick their loot and then oh, as they were going, that's when they, we, we found them, yes. Basson has subsequently instructed his members to regularly conduct stop and search operations to intercept criminals as a surge in farm robberies seem to be on the increase from the typical housebreaking, which appears to be waning. Kaipa Herikanji, NBC News, Vinduk.